Hi there folks, Alan Weiss here with a special for the members of the Odd Couple community. Fripp has produced these wonderful, elegant videos. She's dressed well, so I thought we'd do just the opposite here, and as you can tell, I've been drinking heavily. In any case, this is your first video from me for the Odd Couple community. Uh, I want you to know that uh, Fripp should have sent her books to you by now that you were promised. Million Dollar Consulting will be coming to you the fourth edition in the next two weeks. Million Dollar Coaching and Million Dollar Speaking will be coming to you early next year. Uh, we expect they'll be published by McGraw-Hill in January. Uh, the Odd Couple for next year is now scheduled for June 25th and 26th. Please put it on your calendars. You are all invited. You're all there for free. June 25, 26, 2011, also at the Platinum in Las Vegas. We'll be scheduling monthly teleseminars uh, that Fripp and I will be doing, both of us or one of us. Uh, you'll get that schedule soon. As you know, this officially kicks off in September. In the meantime, I want to invite you to call me or email me if you have questions on professional speaking. So, as your bonus today, Speaking Savvy 6 for this video. That is Speaking Savvy 6 points I'm going to suggest to you just for this video. There's no end to the value, is there? By the way, can you read my shirt? If you can, you're drunker than I am. Now, number one, drop in client experiences and successes in your speaking. Don't just say something about leadership or strategy. Say, when I was working with Citibank, or if you can't say that, when I was working with a major financial institution. I call these parachute stories. You drop them in. So drop in real experiences or amalgams or combinations into your speaking. It livens it up, but it also tells the audience that you're very successful, gives them a feel for whom you've worked. Second, don't focus on the remedial or the negative. Focus on the positive. Focus on growth. Focus on the recovery. The recovery's here. There are starts, there are stops, but the market has uh, already recovered its losses for this year. Uh, it's up uh, in the last couple of days about uh, 300 points. Focus on the positive, not the negative. Have solutions. Don't let your audience be victims. Don't you be a victim. Number three, the news changes rapidly. It changes daily. The BP CEO got kicked out overnight. Make sure you're up to date on what's happening currently so your examples are apt and you can handle questions that come from the floor. This is especially true just before a speech. I make it a habit to listen to the news in the morning on TV or radio and to look at least at the headlines of the Wall Street Journal and the local newspaper before I speak in the mornings. Number four, try to discipline yourself to sending out one press release a week. Just one press release on an accolade you've received, on a speech you've been booked to make, on a new piece of intellectual property, on some controversial or provocative idea. Try to send out one a week. That'll be 50 a year. Your name will get in front of the right people. Related to that, number five, if you see a news story you think relevant for your particular intellectual property, your expertise, Drop the reporter a note and tell the reporter that you have certain information, even offer some of it, and then make the, the open offer that in the future, if they're writing on that subject again, you'll be happy to contribute. By doing this, I was quoted extensively in Florida newspapers on effective and ineffective uh, compensation schedules for nonprofit executive directors. Some blood bank executive directors are making $650,000 a year down there. When the reporter raised some of these issues, I, I dropped a note. He incorporated me in his next four or five stories. And finally, number six, your self-talk informs your behavior. Watch your language. That is the language you're using with yourself. Tell yourself that you're good at what you do, you offer high value, and you deliver beautifully. Don't second guess. Don't get into arguments with yourself. They'll institutionalize you. But be positive. I always am. Nice seeing you. Ciao.